Hello, my YouTube fan out there. Uh, I've been keeping myself sort of busy going through coins, you know, trying to find some of the good stuff. So today I decided I'd just throw out some fun for myself, extra time. And as you can see, I have half two rolls of dimes, two rolls of nickels, and two rolls of pennies. And I don't know if that one might be, look, that might be copper, those two right there, but I'm not exactly sure about that. Because even discoloration don't mean nothing. <laughs> but if you look, that's a fun roll. That's two. Yeah, I've got nothing that I can see. But war nickels are made of 35% silver, and I think the V nickels are, I believe, just regular metals that are made of nickels. And these ones I'm looking for like mercury dimes. The silver, ooh, that looks, that looks promising. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder. So where's she at? That's right, I am gonna stick. There you go. That one looks promising too. Discoloration never hurts. I love how they make them look like they're silver when they're not. <laughs> but oh well, you know, she happens. Well, that's the two rows you can see. That's my point right there. It's pointing to a piece I think that might have promise. Don't see really nothing much inside those. Must have been copper probably inside those. But I will keep you guys informed, so stick around. Well, my YouTube family, these are the stacks of coins that did not make it. I even checked all the 2023s, just in case there might have been the extra V on there. Uh, no luck. I was hoping to find a good coin. Well, not good. I'd more say a fantastic coin, but hey, I, one of these days I get it. But I did set aside coins. I set aside four dimes, and I'll show you why. One nickel, and those pennies. So let's find out why I set this aside, shall we? Okay. No. If you look at the W right there, sorry, yeah, that W right there is sort of wonky, don't you think? I think it has the I N and the W E. Looks like they have issues. Well, the rest of the words in the God and trust are just fine. Let's see if there's anything special on the back. No, oh, but that's just why the weird the weird words. <clears throat> then we got this one. <laughs> now tell me you've seen a dime that looks like that where the W is directly on the line. I think they probably could have moved his head back just a bit. If you look, Liberty is just fine. It's just the W. It's direct on the line and it's just wonky looking, you know what I mean? Third dime. And what do you think about that? That's a grease there. That's gotta be this. You look. On um, the 9, 6, and 5, as well as on the I, N, W, E, and the bottom of the T. Let's see, how about the back for you? How about that? Oh, uh, look at that. Same thing on states and of. It's, 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 it's a double sided grease there. Isn't that, isn't that nice? And, what's in here? Yeah. 
let's see here. That's a pretty thick line. It looks thinner. Like this dime might have been struck off center, but eh. I'm happy with the double sided, double -sided grease error. Okay, what's this, SC? Do you see the outlines right above the fire right there on the one side? I think. I wonder. Let's do a double check, shall we? Let's take a dime that's basically worth a dime. It's weird looking. The leaves look fine. Those are fine. There's no double shots right there, but that you can see the outline of the fire. And then the fire's on the inside. I wonder if that's an error. Eh. But these are my keeper dimes. And I think, let's see here, I think the third dime. Let's see if we got right, this third dime right. Look at that, another walking side of W that's attached to the wall. I'm not showing you that one. Let's, let's make sure here. 1994. 